Hello and a very warm welcome to the Undoubting God YouTube channel where I'll be sharing evidence for the existence of God, for Christianity and discussing other issues connected with the Christian faith. So I would appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel, if you share the video, if you like the video, that would do me a, a world of wonders. Now let me just explain why I have created this channel um, and what the purpose of this channel is. Now, I actually wrote a book called Undoubting God. I published it earlier this year, so in May 2023. And this is a culmination of about seven years of study, of apologetics teaching, and research. Um, back in 2015, I had a thought that lodged into my head. Uh, and at this point, I was an atheist. You know, I, I, I was born in a Christian family, rebelled, you know, around 15, 16, said, I'm not interested in this, stop going to church, no longer identified as anything remotely religious. Um, and just lived a life of being a hedonistic atheist. This is until 2015, August. A question lodged into my mind. Are you sure there is no God? Now, usually I would just bat away such what I thought were silly notions. I thought, of course there's no God. But I didn't have the, the reasons and the evidence and the examples to give clear reasons why. So I decided to do research. I went on a five-month research period, uh, very intensive, and to disprove God uh, so that the next time I would meet one of these stupid Christians, or so I thought, I could tell them that belief in God and belief in Christianity in the Bible is stupid for these reasons. A, B, C, D, and here's the examples, etc. But the more I researched, the more I realized that there is far more evidence for the existence of God and the reliability of the Bible than against it. In fact, it was like, on a heavy weighing scale, it was like this. And I didn't like this. I didn't like it at all. But in December 2015, I had all this information, all this evidence, I should say, and my, my, my desire for truth trumped my feelings. And I reluctantly <laughs> knelt down at the end of the bed and said, all right, Jesus, you win. I, I'm yours. And so from that, that, that's what's really created the passion for apologetics. So I went through that period. I know why Christianity is true. Now, I think everybody should at least be able to explain why they're a Christian. Although most, well, I wouldn't say most, many Christians I've met, they are Christians, but they can't give you clear, concise reasons why they're Christians. So that's, what, that's why I wrote the book. I want to share with the world that faith in God and the Bible is not fairy tales. In fact, it's plausible. I go through the, the chapters in the book, you know, there's nine chapters, undoubting various parts, so undoubting the existence of God, undoubting that science has killed religion or God. There's three chapters on the reliability of the Bible, um, you know, about, you know, about the reliability, the manuscript reliability, history of the Old Testament, History of the New Testament, we look at the how God, you know, in a world of evil, pain, and suffering, how can God be good? We look at the, the supernatural, and yeah, it, 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 I put so much effort and research into that book that I really want to share that faith is not fairy tales. You may have heard, you know, it's just a bunch of fairy tales. You know, I used to believe that, but it's not. And God is real. Now, I've also created the, the, the website, the blog, www.undoubtinggod.com. I've already created about six, seven posts, articles, so go check that out. And the book's available for sale on Amazon. Um, it's on Kindle in paperback, so just go to Amazon, undoubtinggod.com, if you're interested in reading the, the, the book. But the YouTube channel, the purpose of the YouTube channel is to be an extension of the book, but also a companion with the book. And this is a way to, to reach a wider audience, to share much more current issues and just a much wider content to defend the Christian faith and discuss Christian issues. So that's really the purpose of the YouTube channel. As I said, I hope you subscribe to the channel. I hope you like the video. I hope you share the video. And God bless you.